Welcome to the World Tarot News for the 11th of September 2023. Holy Spirit, show us what we need to hear in spiritual news today. Somebody's losing strength, activity. Somebody's not putting in enough effort to do something. This could be a man, doesn't have to be. Flying parrot. So somebody does not have a personality of their own. They don't have any strengths. They can't tell you what strengths or weaknesses they have because they have nothing. This is a copycat. This is somebody whose own personality is a mix of whatever they've seen around them. This is not really a person. This is weird. Jungle home playing the guitar. Somebody could be homeless or on the verge of becoming homeless. Okay, what's going on here? Who is this message about? Let's see. I feel like this is a particular person or a collective of people. Who are we talking about? Eating spaghetti, city character. Somebody could be Italian, possibly. We've got nipping crab here. Somebody could be a cancer, the sign of cancer, or a fire sign. All right. What's the message for today? Holy Spirit, show us what we need to hear today. Again with the cancer, cancer and Scorpio. The truth about a person or a group of people is about to come out. These people are nothing. We've got the king here, but the king, it's like king nothing. So somebody could have a position of power and authority that they don't really deserve and they're about to lose it. Okay, there we go. King nothing is going down, whoever king nothing is. So there is somebody who is put in a place of authority when they can't do anything. They're useless. I'm being very harsh right now. I don't know why I'm feeling like I have to be so harsh, but um, that's what I'm getting here. What do we need to hear in spiritual news today? Four of Swords, Seven of Swords, 47. Somebody could be 47 or born in 47. Eight. Somebody could be going to jail. There could be an older person who's going to jail. Seven. Yeah, it's true. Seven of Cups could be seven people or a group. Look, seven, seven. Somebody could be 77 or born in 77. Could be a water sign who's going to jail. This person had a position of power and authority in the past. Queen of Cups is still on the bottom of the deck. There's definitely a water sign being highlighted here. Six of Swords. We've got a lot of water and a lot of air cards. Somebody could have a lot of water and air in their chart. Or there's a water sign and an air sign. Or a group of water signs and air signs. Something's going to happen very quickly. Very unexpectedly. King of Swords. Yes. Also, this could be a judge, this could be an authority figure, this could be somebody making a decision to take somebody out of their position because they are, they don't know how to use it, they don't know what to do, or they're not doing anything useful. Nine of Pentacles, somebody could have made a lot of money for themselves, somebody's very comfortable, but this person is not useful to anyone else except for themselves, that's what I'm getting, Eight of Wands. There could be an authority figure who's far away from them. Knight of Pentacles, Five of Pentacles. Somebody is about to have something taken away from them. Like I said, it's a position of power and authority. It's money. It's an inheritance. It's something of the sort. So it's like an authority figure is coming in and uh, taking this person. Taking this person. So like I said, the person could actually be arrested. This could be somebody who made a lot of money off of scamming people in one way or another. So this scammer is about to be caught. Yes, it's true. This is a scammer who is about to be caught. And people may not see this person as a scammer. This could be somebody who's very rich. This could be a world leader even. Or somebody who owns a very 
renowned established company, an international company. So there could be another authority figure who's coming in and telling this person you need to step down from your place because you are useless. Basically, that's what I'm getting. Could be an air sign who's stepping in. Doesn't have to be. Ten of Pentacles. Could be a family member of this person. It Yes, with the Ten of Pentacles. Could also be another... I almost said business leader. Yes, it's another person in a position of authority. Six of Wands. Ace of Cups. Four of Pentacles. So it's like this person's coming in and arresting this person or pushing this person out. 48 could be significant. Somebody could be 48 or born in 48. 58 or born in 58. Nine of Cups. Somebody's very self-satisfied, very comfortable where they are. They are in their comfort zone and they want to stay there. Ten of Cups. Look, we've got Ten of Pentacles and Ten of Cups. Okay, so who is taking this person down? Who is replacing this person? I'm getting replaced. I don't know why I said replace. I didn't mean to say replace. But yes, Five of Cups reversed. This could be somebody who's very ruthless. So whoever this King of Swords character is, this family member or this business owner, whoever this is, they're stepping in because they want to take over and they are ruthless, whoever this is. Somebody is very comfortable where they are, but they're not useful to anyone except themselves. So this person stepping in, the, the ruthless person. I've got Two of Wands and Queen of Cups. The Queen of Cups jumped on my chest for some reason, so... <laughs> 62 or 26 could also be significant somebody could be 62 or born in 62 somebody could be 26 but i don't get that i'm getting that there's an older person here who's been in charge for a while now and this person has been very comfortable doing nothing so somebody else is stepping in and taking over this could be a female this could be a water sign or it could be somebody with a more feminine energy the fool, the joker. Somebody's very foolish. Somebody has very bad decision-making skills, possibly. Seven of Wands. So this person might be taking, taken down, like pulled down from where they are. This could be like a coup or something. There could be a coup d'etat or something like that. Seven of Swords, seven, seven. Somebody, again, they could be 77 or born in 77. King of Cups. So there is another person who is secretly planning to take this person down. This could have to do with what I've been talking before. Um, about the particular person who doesn't like monarchy, wanting to take down the monarchies in Europe and elsewhere possibly. Nine of Swords, anxiety. Also, this is Gemini energy. 99 could be significant or the 9th of September. Today is the 11th of September. Somebody could have decided something on the 9th of September. I had trouble speaking, so... Somebody doesn't want me to speak about this because they're planning something in secret. They're planning the coup in secret. They're waiting for their ships to come in. Two of Swords. 92. Something about the year 1992 could be significant. Or Psalm 92 could be significant. Knight of Swords. This person is sitting there. They don't want people to see them coming. They're about to attack someone. Six of Swords. Somebody who could be overseas from them. So this could be an attack... A country could be attacking another country which is far away from them. Could definitely be an air sign doing this. Six, I almost said six of wands. I meant to say five of wands. So this could mean war. 59. Somebody could be 59 or born in 59. There's an attack. Somebody's planning to attack. It could be an air sign in particular. I don't have my other deck, but it could be the Siberian wolf. Uh, they want to attack a country which is five or six countries away from them so somebody who's far away from them or this person wants to take over five or six countries more um yeah somebody's very serious about this ten of cups that's their ten of cups 
Three of Swords. But somebody has a certain ideal and uh, they want to force everyone else to adhere to their ideal. Three of Pentacles. They want people to cooperate. Queen of Wands. Okay, so what's the outcome of this? Something's on the floor. Four of Cups, rejection. Whatever this person plans is going to be rejected. People don't want to hear this. People don't want to cooperate with this person. 44 could be significant. 44 in my other deck is the lunatic. So somebody considers this person to be a lunatic. Yes, exactly. Queen of Swords. So two people or two groups of people don't see eye to eye. Seven of Cups. Somebody is very confused, very delusional. 79, something about the year 1979 or the number 79 could be significant. Also the 7th of September, something could have happened on the 7th of September. The 9th of July could also be significant. Cancer and Virgo energy could be significant. Two of Pentacles. Five of Swords. Somebody's, I'm getting that somebody's a bit off their rocker. Somebody's very demanding. They feel like everyone should bow down to them. That their ideas are better than everyone else's. Also, somebody's sadistic. They have a sadistic streak. Yeah, it's true. The fool came out twice. This one wanted to flip over and then this one. Right, okay. So the outcome could be that somebody's going to be laughed at. Ten of Swords. With the Five of Swords and the Ten of Swords, this could be an assassination attempt or a successful assassin. Yes, it's true. Somebody's about to be assassinated or there's going to be an attempt on their life. Yes, the Fool. Again, Four of Swords will be put to rest. 44 is here again. The Lunatic will be put to rest. Okay. The Queen of Pentacles. 43, 34 could be significant. What is the Queen of Pentacles? Clarify the Queen of Pentacles. Queen of Wands. There's a female involved. Look, lots of queens here. Okay, so there is a person who's about to be assassinated by a woman. And it could be a prostitute who is secretly a secret service agent. Something like that. There is a prostitute who's actually an assassin or multiple prostitutes who are actually assassins. Are we talking prostitutes or something else here? Are we talking about prostitutes free of cups? Free of them. These could be witches too or somebody doing spell work with the free of cups here. Or people having threesomes with a particular man. So there is a man who's interested in dealing with multiple women. And he's going to deal with some women who are actually assassins. I got this message before. Eight of Cups. 38. One of these women could be 38 or somebody is 38 or maybe even born in 38. There are much older people watching tarot than you'd expect anyway. <sighs> than would uh, be suggested by your analytics. Right, okay, so somebody's going to walk into the night because somebody's going to take them out. Whoever this is could be an air sign who will be taken out. Seven of Pentacles could be somebody in their 70s possibly. Or somebody's waiting for something to grow. Somebody's waiting for the results of something they already did. That's also possible. But definitely this is an older man who could be in trouble. Could be in danger because of a group of women. This man could um, look down on women. He doesn't think that they are capable of taking him out possibly. But he's going to be taken out anyway. So there we go. Two of Cups, Queen of Pentacles, the Fool. So this could even be somebody's partner. This could be a business partner or their wife. Their wife could be their enemy or a partner. 
like I said, some form of partner. 84 or 48 could be significant. King of Pentacles. So we had the Queen of Pentacles. Now we have the King of Pentacles. So somebody's own wife or ex-wife. Could also be an ex-wife. Is going to take him out. Three of Wands. Waiting for your ships to come in. Yes, it's true. Somebody's waiting for a result. That's what I'm getting again. Somebody could have done something already. And they're just waiting for this person to... Tower moment. To go. Aquarius or Scorpio could be significant. 34 or 43 again could be significant. So definitely, um, these could also be two women who have a pact together to take this person out. These could be two exes even coming together against the same man. So this could be a message on a wider scale, on a global scale. This could actually be a world leader or somebody who is in a position of leadership. But this could also just be an ex-husband, somebody's ex-husband. Two of his ex-wives could be um, plotting against him together. He doesn't expect them to uh, take him out or take him down. Wow, okay. What else do we need to hear today? Eight of Swords. Somebody's going to jail, though. It could be that one of these wives or ex-wives are going to jail for what they've been plotting. Yes, it's true. They're about to go to jail. They're going to be caught. These two exes could be an air sign and a fire sign. Doesn't have to be. Two scorned women are about to go to jail because they've been plotting on their um, ex. Five of Wands. They could have been plotting to have somebody jumped. They could have paid somebody to jump their ex. 79 or 779. 77 or 79 could be significant. So these women could have paid an assassin or multiple assassins to come after someone. Eight of Pentacles. Nine of Wands. They could have paid. Look, the 19th of August could be significant. Or just the 19th. The 19th of March could also be significant. Somebody could be born on the 19th. 319 could also be significant. Hmm. This King of Cups keeps coming from. They could be... Um, Paying um, a veteran, a war veteran or something like that, a former military man who could be now a um, bounty hunter or something of the sort. Eight of Wands, Eight of Swords, 88. Something about the year 1988 or maybe the 88th Battalion or something like that. It could be the number of um, regiment that this person was a part of or something like that. It doesn't have to be. Or somebody went to war somewhere in 1988, or they've been a military person since 88. Somebody could even be born in 88, but I don't think so. The 8th of August could also be significant. That's in Leo season. Somebody could have done something, or they could have been paid on the 8th of August or something like that. That was the Lionsgate portal. Ten of Pentacles, Two of Pentacles. Yeah, I think this person was paid to do something on that date, possibly. Four of Wands. They could have been paid by um, a female, like I said, or females, a group of females. Knight of Cups, Knight of Wands. With the Knights here, I'm thinking military people or former military or people in a gang, Five of Swords. Two of Wands. Somebody could have been watching another person in secret since uh, August, possibly. Seven of Pentacles and waiting. Somebody was watching and waiting since August. Six of Wands. So that they can have a victory. Eight of Cups, three of Pentacles. Somebody could have walked away from, um, from this group or from this collaboration. So one of these people could have given up trying to hurt the person that they were paid to hurt, possibly. Three of Swords. 
somebody was supposed to be stabbed i think 33 and 53 or 35 could be significant ten of cups two of swords nine of pentacles i think they were supposed to kidnap a whole family or to hold them hostage eight of swords yeah exactly they were supposed to um take a family hostage 88 again so again they were possibly paid on the 8th of August to do this, or they were supposed to do this on the 8th of August. And again, somebody could have done something in 1988 or they're born in 88. What about 88? Can we clarify what about 88? What is this 88 keep coming through here? Eight again. What is 88? It's eight, 888. Um, the number eight talks about karma somebody's karma right these women could have wanted to serve a particular man their karma they wanted to be the agents of karma possibly but eight is also abundance so somebody could have been paid a lot of money to take this person out or their family somebody could also have an eight life path Somebody might have a lot of money. Three of Cups is here again. So there are three eights. We have three of Pentacles and three of Cups. So there could be three karmic relationships. There could be three women who were in karmic relationships with this man. And now they want revenge. This man could also have a lot of money. Three of Cups. Again with the Three of Cups. Look, free, free, free. Eight, eight, eight. It's uh, also Tetris here. We're playing Tetris. Something fits perfectly in place. So that means that I'm putting the message together correctly. That's how I'm interpreting that. <sighs> Two of Pentacles. Four of Pentacles. Somebody is very greedy or somebody needs to protect themselves. Maybe somebody was very good at protecting themselves against whatever was set up for them. Um, somebody could wear a bulletproof vest possibly. There could be somebody who knows that they are in danger and they could be really careful. Queen of Pentacles. Again with the Queen of Pentacles and King of Cups. Who's this Queen of Pentacles? Is this one of the people paying the, the hitman? Or this person's defending themselves against the hitman? Who's the Queen of Pentacles? Are they the ones paying for the hitman? So this could be a wife or an ex-wife, like I said. Who's the Queen of Pentacles? This could also be a business owner. It could be somebody who has a lot of money, male or female. Could be a male too. Look, King of Pentacles. So this could even be a couple. Or it's an earth sign or it's a business owner, like I said. And this person's... Um, did they, did they, did they, oh my God, I can't talk. Somebody could be stuttering or somebody's very anxious. Somebody could also be um, in a hurry. They want to see some kind of outcome faster. Is this the woman who paid for the hitman? Is this the woman who paid Ten of Swords? And Five of Wands wanted to come out, and this is a Yes card. And also something flipped over, Ten of Wands. Ten of Swords, Ten of Wands. Somebody's very burdened. Somebody could have financial difficulties. And um, maybe this person hopes that if they take the man out, they're going to inherit something. Doesn't have to be. This person could also feel very betrayed themselves. This could be just... Um, this could even be somebody who is sick or dying, but they want to take the other person out too. Anyway, yeah, this is the person. It could be an earth sign. It could be a business owner. Clarify who the queen of pentacles is, please. Let's clarify who the queen of pentacles is. King of cups. So this could be a man and a woman. They could have a business together or this is a message which applies for both men and women. The men could be water signs. The women could be earth signs. Usually Queen of Pentacles is considered to be Capricorn. No, not... Oh, interesting. I meant to say Taurus, but I said Capricorn. So it could actually be a Capricorn. I have been picking up on a lot of Capricorn energy before. So it could actually be a Capricorn. 
King of Cups is usually Scorpio, but it could be any water sign. I almost said any air sign, so it could be an air sign too. The man could also be an air sign. So uh, King of Pentacles is here too, which is also Capricorn energy. Look, interesting. We've got the counterparts for each of these characters. So it could be couple, a couple or couples who have been paying these hitman. So these could be multiple situations, multiple similar situations where a couple who could be business owners or they're married or something like that, they're trying to get back at another person or group of people for something that happened in the past, possibly. Or they just want to take out the competition. Yeah, exactly. Knight of Swords, that's why they want to pay for the military guy or the guy in the gang or whatever this is. 81, somebody could be as old as 81 still doing this kind of stuff. Somebody could have also been born in 1981. Or something happened in 1981 and these people could be still holding a grudge. Look, more Tetris here. We've got all the eights here. 8888. Eight, eight, eight. Somebody could be seeing 8888. Eight, eight, eight. Nine of Wands. Somebody's traumatized possibly. There could be a person who's traumatized by something that happened in 1981. Or this person born in 81 has some trauma. Also, somebody could uh, have been in the military and they could have PTSD. And they could be blaming a particular person for this. Five of Pentacles. So if this is a couple, this couple feels left out in the cold like they're losing money. Or they could be losing money because they keep paying for Hitman and holding grudges and not going to church. I'm not sure. Or not believing in God. Not asking God for what they need. So Seven of Swords. Somebody's been doing a lot of sneaky things throughout their whole life. And they got away with it and they're no longer getting away with this seven of wands look 77 is here again something about the year 1977 could be significant somebody's born in 77 or somebody is 77 right somebody could have also been a spiritual leader or they were supposed to be a spiritual leader somebody hasn't been really attending to their um spiritual life yes exactly somebody's very disconnected again yes <sighs> so uh what i'm getting here is that some older people males and females uh need to start repenting for their sins rather than trying to take more people out before they go that's exactly the message i'm getting however this works for whoever this works Somebody had, to a lesser or a higher extent, they had some kind of um, power and authority over others and they've been abusing it. So these are the people who need to stop trying to control everyone around them, stop and look at themselves and ask for forgiveness for their own issues. Knight of Pentacles, somebody needs to stop with the Knight of Pentacles. Also, they keep paying people to do their dirty work for them and they need to stop doing that too yes somebody's very ruthless five of cups reversed also these very ruthless people could be dealing with another person we've got the fool here twice so this is another leader in a particular industry or in this world yeah who could be plotting to take these people out as they want to take out others i said this before it's just a reoccurring theme somebody's really focused on a person or a group of people when they need to look behind them to see who has something directed at them two of pentacles five of cups 75 somebody be 75 or they could be born in 75 275 or the 27th of may could be significant that's in gemini season 23, somebody could be 23 or born on the 23rd. The 23rd of March could be significant. 
free, free, free. Nine of Swords reversed. Somebody needs to get over some kind of anxiety. They need to cut through the BS. 91, the year 1991 could be significant for someone. And the 19th of September is here again. Something could be happening on the 19th of September. Yes, exactly. 911. Somebody could be calling the police on the 19th of September. Or, like I said, somebody could be arrested on the 19th of September. But today is 911, it's 9 11, right? The 11th of September.